October 31st, 2024. I'm Bella. And I'm Sadie. And Bella's looking extra scary today. Mm. That's not very nice. Oh, I'm sorry. Happy birthday today to one person on Halloween, Michael Ciccarelli. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Have the best day. And the saint of the day today is St. Wolfgang of Regensburg. Please check the hallway TVs for more information. The Bible verse of the day is Psalms chapter 23, verse 4. Even though I walk through the valley of the shadow of death, I will fear no evil. <coughs> For you are with me, your rod and your staff, they comfort me. On the menu today in the Saints Cafe, grilled chicken, rice, spinach, artichoke, artichoke dip, and pita chips. Mm -mm -mm. You know who loves that one? Who? Abby Pitzel. She will like it. Special mm. Halloween treat for her. Now, everyone, get off your phones, wake up, and listen up. These announcements are important. Mm -hmm. Breaking down the walls is coming back to Aquinas, November 12th and 13th. Chathan will be back again, leading us once more. Don't miss out. Sign up using the QR codes in the hallways. Teens for Life News! Service hours, service hours. Sadie, are your service hours done? My service hours are not done. Well, then you need to listen up. So true. Teens for Life has some service hours this weekend and next. Maybe you should sign up. I think I'm going to. This weekend, Saturday, November 2nd, is the first Saturday prayer. Mass at 8.15 a.m. at Nativity, 9 a.m. Planned Parenthood Overland Park, and then breakfast. You can earn one to three service hours. And you know what? We have another opportunity for next weekend, wow. Saturday, November 9th. We have a service project, 9 a.m. to 3 p.m., working at St. Mary's Home for Mothers, working to help women who want to have their babies and need our help. Six hours of service. Email or see Mrs. Loafman in room 124 to sign up to participate. Come pray with us and come work with us for the mothers and the babies. Campus Ministry News! November is the month of remembrance and... One. Campus Ministry invites you to submit the names of your loved ones who have passed away within the past year through a Google form in your email. These names will be offered in prayer at our upcoming Requiem Mass on November 6th at 8.20 a.m. Number two. two! During the month of November, photos of your loved ones can be displayed in our chapel windows as we remember all the saints who have gone before us. Bring, bring your... Bring your photo and place it at any of our windows in the chapel or bring it to Ms. Salazar or Mrs. Eikenberry and they will place it for you. Please make sure your name is on your photo. All photos must be picked up at the conclusion of the month of remembrance, no later than December. Extravaganza volunteers, opportunities for freshmen and seniors. Sign up quickly as we are only taking 50 senior envoys and 30 freshman and parent <laughs> combos. Check the hallway TVs for the QR code to sign up before it is too late. Me it, and Bell are signing up. We are. The annual Catholic Charities Canned Food Drive starts next week. We are hoping for a great drive this year, but we need everyone's help. Please consider donating to this fantastic cause. Keep an eye out for any emails and social media posts with information on how to contribute. If you have any questions at all, ask a SUCO member or Mr. Hammonds. Thank you! Hey Sadie, did you know what page 40 of our handbook says about food being delivered to our school? Um, no, what does it say? It says, and I quote, students may not order food from outside vendors and the front office will refuse any food brought in by any outside vendor or food delivery service. Um, but I actually saw someone eating food that had been delivered just the other day. Well, that may have slipped by, but going forward, the front office will refuse to accept any food. But what if my mom calls in food because I forgot my lunch? Nope, it will not be accepted, so save the effort and buy something in the cafeteria. But you can have your mom bring you your food, just not DoorDash or something like that. Yep. And on Saint Sports! Um, attention senior students, have you committed to play a sport at the next level? If you would like to participate in a mock signing ceremony on Wednesday, November 13th, please stop by the Student Life Office to get on the list of participants. This ceremony is for senior student athletes who have committed to play a sport at the collegiate level. The ceremony will be held right after school in the theater. Please sign up by Friday, November 8th. We are action-packed with sports. Volleyball Friday, football Friday, cross-country Saturday. Let's go Saints! Thank you for watching the Halo Morning Show. We will be back with more for you tomorrow. I'm Sadie. And I'm Bella. Signing off. Remember, stay classy, Saints, and pass it on.